Hello everybody, this is D3PO from WMClan.net. In this tutorial you will see how to make a good render. To get started, just make your model. Sorry I can't talk today, I'm not feeling too good. So I'm like crap. And one minute. Anyway, go into just the select tab. Go over to lights and just select skylight. Just place it anywhere in your model, it doesn't matter. Okay, now you can just pop that up one. I don't care. It doesn't matter really. Um, I can, whoops, my lord. I'm not sure I only have one sky. Okay, good enough. Go into rendering, advanced lighting, light tracer. Make sure this is active. And go ahead and hit render. I'll actually... Go ahead and change this to gray if you don't have a clay. In this case, I'll just use a clay color since I already have one. Go ahead and go into advanced light and right tracer and hit render. Okay, what I'm going to do here is add a little more detail to the model so that you can see kind of the full capacity of what this can do. So I'm just going to bring this out a little bit. So I can see the shadow. And bring that up a tad bit. Okay, I'll try that again. As you can see, there's a lot more shadow going on right now than in the last render. Okay, and now what I'm going to do is save this as... Save it to my desktop. I'm going to save it as... Um, render one dot png. Go ahead and hit save. Just hit OK. And then go ahead and delete the skylight if you want to see the difference. And just change this back to the color it was by default. And go ahead and do the render again. And save it as render two dot png. Okay, now what I'm going to do is go to my desktop. <laughs> Whoops, past it. This. I'm just going to preview this. And this. Well now. Hopefully I won't have to open up Photoshop. It might open, but that's okay. I don't know, that worked. Okay, as you can see as I'm flipping through here, the clay render has quite a bit more detail. And you can really see the potential of the model, even though it's just a crappy model I made for the tutorial. Anyway, now what you can do is upload this. In my case, I'm just going to use Photo Bucket for this tutorial. So, photobucket.com Go ahead and log in. Wow. Old stuff. As you can see, this is some more of my models. That's really blurry because it's a JPEG. And the not blurry one, as you can see, it's quite a bit more detail to it. Now I'm just going to upload it now. So 
go to my albums browse desktop render one good render yay and render two actually I'm going to save render two as a jpeg so it's even worse so render two dot jpg and I got the worst quality even though the best I'll just do the best doesn't matter okay render two dot jpeg and Holy crap, bad render. Upload. Takes a few seconds to upload depending on your upload speed. Oh my lord. I cannot talk today. Here we go. It's almost done. And just save and continue. Okay. Now as you can see this looks absolutely horrible. And you can just copy image location as you can see. Or actually you can go down to the direct link and post that on web pages. As you can see there. Well and here's the good one. As you can see there's quite a bit of difference between the two. Uh, let's see if I can do this. No, that didn't work. <laughs> nice. Anyway. Uh, this is the end of the tutorial. Tutorial, my lord. Uh, hope you learned something.